Hey fam, welcome back to another video at I Love Me, Me, Me. <laughs> so I had an event recently and I did a question and answer portion of it. And so my question today is actually coming from that event, but I wanted to make sure that I answered this question because maybe a lot of you out there are experiencing this. The question is, what if I'm doing everything that you suggested and my deal breakers list is very short, it's only four items, but I'm still not finding the guy that I want. I'll answer that after this. All right, fam, thanks for coming back. So before I go ahead and jump into the answer, I want to just remind you guys about my three online courses. The very first course is for my super single people out there. You are just sick and tired of dating just because. You also want to understand who you are, what you want, what you need, and how you are actually going to show up as soon as you are ready to date again. That course is going to help you figure out all of that. The second course is for any of you guys in the dating stages. I mean, you are just sick and tired of just dating in the hopes that everything is going to fall into place. And you need some help with just getting clear about what you should be doing, what questions you should ask, and it's absolutely going to help you to build up your confidence so when you are in the dating stages, you know exactly what to look for, and even some of the BS that comes to you from some of the guys, guess what? You'll be able to block, 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 move on a lot faster, and not waste unnecessary time because the time is the only thing that we cannot replace. Time is very precious. The third course is for anybody that's in a long-term relationship or a marriage and you really want to bring some spice back into your relationship. You need to truly connect back with your boo because you guys have been taking each other for granted and now you need to figure out a way to get things back, bring that spice and fun back to your relationship. That course is going to help you out. So definitely go ahead and check out the perspective course depending on where you are in your life. All of my courses and the links are linked in the description box below. So go ahead and purchase the program that you need. Do the work because that's the only way it's going to work. You have to do the work. But you will notice a complete difference in the woman that you are and the relationship that you have. So now to answer her question, I have to say that there are two parts to this. So, okay, everything that I have suggested, you're already currently doing. You have a deal breakers list. You are following it when you go out on the dating scene, but you are still not finding the guy. So the first thing that I would say to you is, because you guys weren't there, she actually mentioned that she seems to keep dating the same person over and over again. So maybe, she has not learned the lesson that she needs to learn in order to move past that guy. Yes, every time that she said that she's been out on a date, she's found a guy who doesn't have any ambition or maybe he doesn't work or, you know, um, he's, he's intimidated by uh, the position that she's holding now, maybe even what, what her um, money the money that she's bringing in. And so she keeps meeting this same guy who doesn't have any ambition and all of the other things that I just mentioned. And so maybe you have not learned the lesson that you needed to learn from that. And then secondly, I would have to say, God is still working on you. And God is still working on your potential mate as well. And so even if you guys have met, God is not ready for you guys to connect the way that he needs for you to connect because neither one of you are ready to meet each other. Neither one of you are ready to take it to the next level because there are some things that you need to work on. There are some things that he needs to work on. 
And as soon as you guys work on these pieces of the puzzle, God will actually either rekindle your relationship so you guys can meet up again or introduce you to said guy. So that's my opinion about it. Not ready. You say you're doing everything right, but you haven't learned the lesson because you keep meeting the same person over and over again. Different face, different body, but the exact same thing. And then maybe God's just not ready for you to meet them because you're truly not ready. And even when I ask this young lady, do she think that she deserves the type of relationship that she wants with the four um, things that are on our deal breaker list? And she was like, yeah. And I have to be honest with her. I was like, that didn't sound convincing, sis. And so what she's saying outwardly, she doesn't truly believe it, which is why she's not attracting it. She's like, yeah. And I'm not mocking her or anything. I'm just letting you know that it, it wasn't convincing. She, didn't, she wasn't like, yeah, yeah, I deserve that. It was like, yeah question mark and so when you guys are out there and you feel that you are dating the same person over and over again just think about the two things that I said to her think about what the lesson is that you need to learn so you can learn it so you can move on so those particular guys or even particular girls will stop approaching you that you will stop approaching them because your standards will be raised I love that Tony Robbins always says that Raise your standards to get the life that you want. In this case, to get the relationship that you want. You have to raise your standards. But first, you have to know what the issue is. You have to identify what the issue is. So you can raise your standards. And I am Christian. I believe in God. If you are here, more than likely you do too. But even if you don't, your higher power, the universe, whoever it is that you pray to, it's a lesson that you need to learn, which is why the universe is not connected you guys together. In my case, God has not connected you guys together because there is some work that still needs to be done on yourself and on your partner, which is why you guys have not met or have not rekindled the friendship that will blossom into a relationship. So fam, I'm interested to hear what you have to say. Was the advice good? Was it bad? Have you been in a situation like this? Are you currently in a situation like this? You feel that you are doing everything that I have been suggesting to you, but you still have yet to meet your guy. You have still yet to meet your girl. What are you willing to do different from this day forward? Are you going to be able to identify your issue so you can start working on it? So you can get some clarification on it. Those are the questions that you have to answer. So definitely go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Of course, subscribe, especially if this is your very first time here. Hit the red subscribe button or the icon with my lovely face because here at I Love Me, 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 I'm supplying you guys with all of the tips and tools in order to have happy, healthy, romantic relationships. I will see you again in a future video. Deuces.